Hey guys, I want to talk to you a little bit about my wife's Jeep. Um, we did what we call an Amazon build on it. Um, pretty much everything you see on here we got off of Amazon. We went with a uh, three and a half inch rough country lift. Um, we had it put on by our local shop. And we went with Opar bumpers, front and rear, with the LED lights in them already. Um, they work really good for what we do with it. On the weekends, we go off-roading at our local, not off-road parks, but up north and, you know, all that stuff. We live in northern Michigan, so we don't need to see for miles, like out in Glamis and sand dunes and all that stuff. Um, <clears throat> they work really good. After we put the lift on, we ended up having to go with a, uh, a steering stabilizer, and we went with the dual Skyjacker because once we lifted it and put the 35s on it it was all over the road and with that dual steering stabilizer the push pull it made a big big difference um <coughs> she went with the 20 inch xd wheels uh not really what she was looking for but she settled with them she's happy with them she did um etsy stickers and stuff like that um this right here we put the um light bar on and it whistled like crazy and uh, apparently it's a pretty common problem with the jeeps we did this thing called the aero lid and as you can see it's kind of like an airplane lid and there is no more whistle you can customize them the light does not go through this you do have to take it off at night if you're using it off-road but we can deal with it you know <clears throat> um, didn't do any step bars yet she's kind of waiting to find out what she wants to do with those we did go with an Aturo uh, I think they're the Trailblade yeah the Trailblade MTs they have about 7,000 miles on them and these things are wearing like steel they've been rotated once they are loud but it's a Jeep it's not a highway cruiser um, did the inserts on the door handles and uh that's pretty much it um it's a 2018 wrangler jk um the towing uh package that is on it is built into the bumper which i'm not crazy about but um it is what it is it's rated for up to 3500 pounds honestly if we tow 1200 with it that'll be about it she had a custom tire cover made. Uh, we just kept the, cut, the stock tire on it. <clears throat> um, if we get it flat and figure it out when we get there, I guess, you know. Um, we go to Silver Lake Sand Dunes in Michigan quite a bit. Spent a lot of time over there. So just figured I'd make a video and show you guys what we have. Um, the stance on the thing with the uh, 1250s uh, tires, I, I like the look of the Jeep. And it's pretty capable. I mean, for pretty much stock, the only thing we did have to do when we put the 35s on it was put, uh, we had to go to a 488 gear because she ended up taking it down the highway. She drives the highway to work every day, but not um, too far, maybe 12 miles, 13 miles a day but she said it was kicking in and out of overdrive when she did that. And so we took it over and we uh, had Iron Man Off-Road and Shields put a 488 gear in it. No lockers, no nothing like that. It's not crazy off-road stuff. So um, we like it. It fits our needs. We take the dogs, stuff like that. Just go cruising in the woods. We just wanted something dependable we could take. So there it is, 2018 JK.